It's time for Tech Time with Timmy. Hello, welcome to Tech Time with Timmy. In this episode, Timmy's going to be talking about how to pair Google Home with a Bluetooth speaker. So, uh, Google Home is a very cool smart device made by Google, and it can play music, and you can ask it a whole lot of questions and stuff, so it's really cool, and Timmy's made a whole lot of videos about Google Home, so you can watch those ones if you want, if you want to know more about Google Home. So, if you have Google Home, you can ask it to play out its speakers, so it'll come out the speakers it has, and the Google Home Max and the Google Home, and even the Google Home Mini have really good speakers. The Google Home Mini speakers are not quite as powerful, though, so maybe Maybe you might have a really powerful Bluetooth speaker and you just want the really easy functionality when you can ask Google Home to play something. There is actually a way that you can pair a Bluetooth speaker with Google Home and then easily have it play through the speaker. So it's really cool and in this episode Timmy's going to show you how to do that. So what you have to do first is you need to get your Bluetooth speaker. Timmy's actually using a light globe so it's got a light globe with a speaker in it which is pretty cool. And so you turn it on and it's turned on now. But so you need to turn on your Bluetooth speaker and then you need to enable pairing mode. So sometimes to enable pairing mode you just have to have it on and not connected to a Bluetooth device. Other times you might have to press a button or something, but so it's really really quite easy. So if, if you don't know how to en enable pairing mode on your Bluetooth speaker, it should be it should say in the instructions how you can enable pairing mode. So that's pretty cool. So you just need to look that up and then once you've enabled pairing mode, you then need to get a phone or tablet and go into the Google Home app. You probably already have the Google Home app because it's very if you're gonna have Google Homes and stuff you really need this app. And then so open the app and then tap on the devices button in the top right corner and so this is where you'll find all of your different devices, all your Google Homes so you can tap on this little three dots in the top right corner of the Google Home you want to pair sometimes to me says it doesn't matter which one you choose but this time it does because you're pairing the specific Google Home so then in the menu that pops up here tap on settings and then scroll down pretty far down to choose default music speaker so you can tap on that and then it's currently set to studio speaker which is the device it is so it will just play out its speakers and you can choose a different Google Home if you want and it will just play like that or you can select pair Bluetooth speaker so just tap on pair Bluetooth speaker and it will come up with this one that's the name of the Bluetooth speaker so if yours was named something else it would say something else so find your Bluetooth speaker here and tap on it and then it should, it will probably take a few seconds and that's the sound from the Bluetooth speaker saying that it's just paired with a device so that's done and then you can just tap done and then so now anything that you say for, if you ask your Google Home to play something it'll still say okay playing this out of its speakers but then once it's set it out of its speakers it will then play the actual song or audiobook or whatever you want out of the Bluetooth speaker so it's really cool if you want to have a Bluetooth speaker with all the cool functionalities of Google Home. So that's really cool. And then if you ter later turn off your Bluetooth speaker and ask Google Home to play something, it will just play out of its speakers like normal. So that's really cool as well. And then if you turn the Bluetooth speaker back on again, it'll just repair and then it'll keep going like that. So that's really cool. And that's how it works. And that'll be the end of this episode of Tech Time with Timmy. Bye.